All right, so I got the latest version, 2019.16.2 of the software for my Tesla. And um, I got some comments from you guys saying that now it will work with Homelink. And it also says that in the release notes that the improvements has been made to the Homelink system. And uh, if you haven't seen, uh, we had some trouble with the 868 MHz controllers for the Homelink system uh, with the Tesla Model 3 here in Europe. So uh, let's see. We're going to try to program my remote to the car and then the car to the uh, garage door opener. So the first thing you need to do is to press here, create home link, uh, and uh, set a name. I will just call mine home. All right, and then it says, before we begin, here's what you need to do. Have your garage door uh, remote ready. You will want to use, uh, you may want to use new batteries. I already uh, entered new batteries in my remote uh, when we had some trouble with this and tried, when I got my Model 3, I tried to connect it to the Homelink system and it didn't work. So I replaced the batteries then. And then, Park in front of the garage door, be sure to leave enough room for it to open. And there I have my associate, my son actually, that will help me out because uh, I, you need to program the garage door opener as well. So let's start. Okay, so uh, he will now um, use the remote control. And uh, yeah, it. Uh, it found it, and um, then we need to click continue to go to the next step. So if you press that, if you press that button once again, uh, you will open the garage door, and you can go in and uh, start programming when I say so. Right. So we click continue. And then um, train the receiver. Press the learn button on your garage operator, usually located behind the cover. Da da da. So uh, we'll uh, press that in the garage. Now it's pressed. We click continue. Training may uh, may take up to a minute. Tap continue to move to the next step. Uh, your new home link is now programmed. To verify that it is working correctly, tap the home above. So we click that. And as you can see, now it works. It closes and we tap it again. It should stop. And tap it again. And it opens. All right, so there you have it. In 2019.16.2, the home link system works in Europe with uh, even the 868 MHz remote controls. And uh, we didn't have to change in the hardware or anything. It was just a software update. Perfect. I'm really happy. Now I can uh, actually uh, use the built-in uh, system in my car. I don't need to have a remote anymore. Lovely. Thanks for watching, drive safely, and I see you in the next one.